This is a natural and spiritual family. Okay, since I'm up here, um, since I've been sitting here for the last few days, um, I have lived my life from the beginning to now. I've, I've lived all over the world. I've lived in, born in Cleveland, Ohio, raised in New York City, lived in Lincoln, Nebraska with cousins, cousin Edna, lived in Washington, D.C., <laughs> anyway, I have relived all the places that I've lived for some reason. I'm reliving it this week as this new year is coming. Because as much as I hate to admit it, and I'm grateful for it, I'll be 86. And for me to say that, I have lied about my age all of my life. Yes, yes, you have. Haven't I? I've lied. I've lied about my age. You know, when the whole time I was in London, they never knew how old I was. They always thought I was 10, 15 years younger, even more. Because when in London, when Jamaicans and Africans, when they get older, they cook a big dinner for their family on Sundays and they sit by the window. And I was still partying and cooking and enjoying myself and lying about my age. So for me to have told them how old, I've told some of them, not all of them, how old I am, they started screaming in the phone, including the people that I worked with here at CBS Records because I was in the music business. And I told some of my friends who are much younger than I, how old I was, and they didn't believe me, and they started screaming in the phone, and they've been helping me up the steps since then. <laughs> That's what I was afraid of. <laughs> but anyway, um, I've had quite a life. Um, I was telling someone today what happened with me when I was very young, my mother died in a car accident, and I was driving the car. It was a sports car, and I ended up destroying my hip joint. I'd had six surgeries since then on my hip. But you overcome that because you finally figure out that God is with you, that you're not carrying it yourself. You're not carrying right. it at all. Right. Right. And I've overcome that. I've overcome my sister passing. There are only two of us. Right. My father dying at a very early age. And you think that your world's going to end. And you really, if you're in the music business like I was, which is all fantasy, mm -hmm. you really think that it's up to you. And you finally find out that it's not. Come on. That it's not. That, that God has been carrying you, yes. and I've told him today, I've told him many times recently, that how much I appreciate it. I never expected to live this long. I could have died in the car accident. I was driving, it was a two-seater. Right. I could have died myself. But he has a plan, so evidently I'm not finished yet. Right. I'm still here, and um, Looking forward to the new year and want to be encouragement to you all who yes. have gone through, because I'm not married. Well, I was married five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Left him behind in the That's dust. Awesome. You get over it and you keep on going. That's right. 
So, anyway, I want to encourage everyone and those of you who are going through broken relationships, loss of mother, loss of father, loss of sisters, loss of friends, that this is all temporary. This is a temporary state. That we're, we're just passing through here. Right? And God is eternal, and that's our next destination. And when they finally realize that, when you realize that, then you'll, you'll be able to move forward and be able to help those that you will come in contact with along the way. Yeah. Help them, because God lives in eternity and he's going to be waiting for us if we right. understand that he loves us, we love him, and that is our next destination. So I wish all of you a very happy new year. This is my church. I've joined a lot of churches in my lifetime too, too, in every city and country that I've lived in. So I want to tell you that. So I love my family here. We started out together. Oh my goodness. Haven't we gone through a lot? Anyway. I'm here today and love you all, and if there's anything I can do to help or encourage you, feel free to come and, and call me or see me. Amen. All right, happy new year. God bless.